My name is Alexandra. I studied on the MA Refugee Protection Program. I was in half of the time in Jordan and then the other half in the U.S. with my family. I, I really enjoyed that it was a program online because I could be working. I was working full time while also interning and then able to study at um, my own pace. I really enjoyed the type of materials that were given and then also the professors. Um, the program allowed for coffee chats with the professors, so whenever the time worked well for you, you can meet them. And then there are also other opportunities to engage, like for example, uh, there's the RLI conference and then also blog posts and um, different working papers that allow you for more opportunities. I, I think another part that I really enjoyed about the program was that students were from all over the world and you could get perspectives from any country, any subject that you can think of and um, in areas that maybe you have more of an interest um, from climate change to gender. Um, I really enjoyed that experience. Uh, I'm Tyler Lloyd, I'm in my second year of the program and I think for me one thing that I really enjoyed most about the program is uh, which you won't find in a lot of academic contexts, is the ability to engage and collaborate with students from all over the world uh, in many different time zones. And I think on an issue like migration, I think that's especially important because you get a lot of really interesting perspectives on uh, such an important and global issue. So I really appreciated that part of the program. One of the unique aspects of the program, being an online program, it gives opportunity to so many of us who not have the capacity to travel to UK to study. So I, I feel it was a great opportunity for so many, I know it, I was not alone, but so many others who would not have the opportunity. But it opened up, I mean, opened up doors for us. So I'm so happy about that. Hi everyone, so my name is Elodie. I come from Switzerland and I just started the MA in Refugee Protection and Forced Migration. So I'm very happy with this program because it enabled me to um, combine work uh, with a topic I'm really interested in. So I come from the communications and PR field. So I've already had a master five years ago and I work now for five years and I'm really trying to re reorientate, so change career. And this is a great opportunity for me to, to continue working in communication and gain um, expertise in the field of uh, refugee protection. My aim is then to work uh, as an advocate for international organization and I think this program will, will give me the right tools uh, to get there. Hi, my name is Kate Pisigova. I started the program in October 2022. Now currently I'm on my second commodium. I find the program very interesting even though it's quite challenging. I don't have any practical experience in the field, so I just got curious about the program, especially when the Russian-Ukrainian war started, and I was volunteer, uh, volunteering to help uh, Ukrainian newcomers who arrived to Canada, and I found out that they have many issues and I got interested in learning and how we as a society can address those issues, and I found this program. I'm so happy that I came to this conference because actually I found so many questions uh, that I had in my head and I met uh, people who are very passionate about the same issues that I am passionate about and so far it's going good so I highly recommend this program for people who want to uh, build an um, equal and fair society. Studying the MA, uh, especially because it was part time, it allowed me to look for part time work in the field, and I feel like that gave me uh, a really good balance of practical experience. And then being able to study alongside it gave me more of a global context and try and understand uh, what I was seeing in my day to day job.